It's a slap. That's a free hit slap. Oh, that wasn't meant to go there. That's beaten the man. He's up inside the ring. It was uh, slightly unintentional. No third man. Outside edge, thick edge, four. So it hit, gets it past Shahida Fridi into the fence. It's a small boundary. Up in the air and uh, gets over the 65 yard fence. Caught behind, yes. He's gone after hitting a six. That's a great, great bowling performance. Because he didn't drop his uh, his line or length. He was at it, and so the first wicket has gone down. Shahzeb caught behind, looking for another shot over the infield. Caught behind for 18. It's 41 for one. Hit uh, decently. Oh, and it's a four. There's a lot of confusion between the two. One, one. Looking for two. One. Oh, that'll be tight. That'll be very tight. A great throw from the deep. And we're going to have a look upstairs. The toe end of the bat is on the crease, and the bales are broken when he is slightly short of the crease. Cool and cool decision, we await. And it's out. O-U-T in red. Joe Wilson is the TV umpire. Big shot, so good. And that's a gigantic sixth. Away again. Too wide from a Freddy. Inviting the cut. Bald aim, it goes down as bold. And Lendl Simmons looks completely bemused. And a serious face on the side of the Peshawar captain, Shahid Afridi. Simmons has got to go. A fine innings it was for Karachi Kings. He's gone for 49 from 37. It's 83 for three. Straight back, hit hard. It's got enough on it for four. That's a delightful stroke from Bopara. Down the leg side, gone, catch. Imran Khan Jr. takes the catch, comfortable catch. And it's a wicket that so often falls the first ball after a timeout. Shoaib Malik has got to go, caught Imran. Khan Jr. off the bowling of Yamin for 15. It's 97 for four. Oh, lovely, lovely placement from Ravi Bapara. That's a skyer. This should be taken. Running catch, and it takes a good one. Abdul Rahman, nice pair of hands. Shakibul Hassan just couldn't come to grips with the state of the pitch or the lack of pace on the pitch. And so another one bites the dust. They wanted Shakib out there because he's a sweet timer of the ball, but it's not been his league. One for 11, 127 for five. Oh, well struck. Oh, yes, well done. Terrific piece of bowling. He was getting under his skin. Ravi Bopara was at sixes and sevens, very confused, extremely frustrated. And in the end, lot one back to the bowler who took a good one, had to change directions. And Ravi Bopara is gone for 23. It's a big wicket. 134 for six. Very good one. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. What a way to begin your scoring. Oh, that's gone up in the air. Will this be taken? Not really. It's another six. 
Good ball, Yorker. Direct hit. Oh, Sammy, you've done it. Finger has been raised. He loves it, absolutely loves it. He, he gave that out as well, Darren Sammy. Big smile on his face. He plays the game with the right spirit. And a terrific fielder and a great strike to get rid of Swail Khan for seven. It's 147 for seven. That's gone up in the air. Is it safe? It is safe. Two runs. Keepers in. Keepers in. And, well, he hits the, the runner with that throw. And so at the end of it all, Kings 1-5-2 for the loss of seven. Yeah, it's a must-win game for Karachi Kings, even though they'll have a chance um, when they play their last one, but they shouldn't leave it that late. 152 for seven. Simmons 49 and uh, well set up uh, the show for them but they just couldn't finish off the Zalmi's bowling attack which was good Amir Yameen and Hassan Ali and Imran Khan Jr both playing for the first time in including Abdul Rahman in this HBL PSL and not doing a bad job of it nine extras 153 is what the uh, Zalmi will uh, need to win this one and pocket another impressive win. That's wide. That's not a good ball to start. Much too wide for the likes of Mohamed Afiz. Short's gone straight up in the air. It's got to be a catch. He's gone. Ricky Vessels takes a comfortable catch. And a smart piece of bowling accounts for Mohamed Afiz. He's got to go. Done for pace. Good short ball, climbing quite sharply. And Mohamed Hafiz, a big wicket. It's gone for four. It's four for one. Hit well and hit down at backward point for four. So a much needed boundary. <laughs> oh, no. In the air and out. So a change of pace, a change of angle has produced a critical wicket with the weather looming. It certainly has. It's the end of Milan and it couldn't have come at a worse time with rain imminent. Milan goes for eight, it's 25 for two. Beautifully swept away for four. Waked away into the distance it goes. One bounce over the rope. Yeah, he's threaded that through. And that's the danger with the pace off the pitch, as you were just mentioning. Oh, that's close. That's close. Great appeal. It was a good appeal. And the umpire thought the ball was good enough as well. And once again, the talented Osama Mir has provided the goods. He's taken a wicket. Alamy's got to go for 31 from 29. It's 58 for three. Gone. No one could have stopped that. It would have flown over second slip, and he could have been a 12-foot giant. You still wouldn't have caught it oh now they now they know yeah oh collision accidental accidental has to be said but a has got to go lbw and a is a very unhappy captain out there i don't think he wanted to be out there i think he's worried about the light and the lightning that was a completely accidental, but Afridi's LBW to Bilal Bati for five, 69 for four. That's into the gap. That's well struck. It's a short boundary, so you've got to be on top of your fielding game. That's gone through. Well, that's delightfully struck. What a good shot. Straight past the bowler. Whoa, bang, he's hit that very hard and a great effort to stop it. 
Ricky Vessels did his best to stop it. That was really flying, that ball. He's hit that well, really hard. Can't put fielders there behind the bowler. और क्राउड के बारे में मैं क्या कहेंगे जबरदस्त क्राउड हमने देखा है सपोर्ट भी पाकिस्तान में अमेजिंग रहा है क्या बात है जी अब इस तरह से जो पाकिस्तानी क्रिकेट है उसको बहुत ज़्यादा सपोर्ट मिलेगी और जिस तरह से जो शायकीन है मैं ये समझता हूँ कि अगर अगर ये टूर्नामेंट ये मेरी अपनी पर्सनली राय हो सकती है ये गलत भी हो सकती है अगर ये मई में होता तो बहुत ज़्यादा लोग और भी आते और ख़ास तौर पे ये नाइट मैच टूर्नामेंट होता फ्लड लाइट टूर्नामेंट होता तो बहुत सारे लोग जो जो हमारे जो पाकिस्तानी जो काम करते हैं उनको आने का भी जल्द मौका मिलता अभी लोग जो हैं वो अपनी ड्यूटियों पे हैं तो इसलिए वजह से थोड़ा वो चले आवाम के लिए एक लाइन भी सुना दें बड़ी रिक्वेस्ट है आपके लिए तेरे मस्त मस्त दो मेरे दिल का ले गए चैन मेरे दिल का ले गए चैन तेरे मस्त मस्त दो बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया आपका बहुत शुक्रिया अगेन एक्स्ट्रा कवर दिस टाइम एन अ सिक्स व्हाट अ मास्टर क्लास फ्रॉम हॉज Hodge goes to extra cover again. He's called for two, and he'll get there comfortably. Oh, I tell you what, that might be close at the non-striker's end. I tell you what, that's very important moment in the game. Not only is it a big wicket, but it's one less run. Akmal has to go, I'm afraid. Yes, it is. The cool and cool decision shows out. Cameron Akmal departs, and he departs for eight, and it's 121 for five. Again, six. Unbelievable strike over cover. Yes, a full toss, but what a shot! Oh, well bowled. Unlucky. Extremely unlucky. This is a cruel game. Oh dear! Fetch it if you can. Again, it's a repeat. They're doing this for the canter. Hodge moves to 83, four required. There it is. It's all over. All over with a six. So a comprehensive win. For Zalmi, and uh, a lot of it down to a very good innings from Brad Hodge, finished on 85. Well, <laughs> you don't have to look further than that 85 in the middle. 60 of those runs coming in boundaries, and just 45 balls. Sammy finishing it off. My goodness, what an avalanche on the bowling attack that was. Yeah, very, very tough for the bowlers when you get someone in such full flight. Ravi Bopara, normally the trump card in the pack, but uh, just the one over 16. Mohamed Amir with the best, best figures of one for 29 off his four. So at the end of all that, it ended up a comfortable win for Peshawar Zalmi, winning by five wickets with time to spare.